Hi guys, so I'm going to be trying to do some regular videos for you again. Um, I haven't been reading much, so I haven't been posting a whole lot of videos. Um, life has been kind of hectic. Uh, but uh, anyway, I bought like eight books this month, so hopefully that will jumpstart my reading again. So let's get right on into the books that I bought this month. First, I have Scorpio Races by Maggie Stavotter. And I'm very, very excited about this. I heard nothing but great things. <laughs> Oh, yeah, hiccups. Um, anyway, I heard nothing but great things about this, and I'm very excited j to jump into this. I love Maggie Savada's writing after reading The Raven Boys, so I'm just very, very excited about that one. Next, I have Cuckoo's Calling by Robert Galbraith, a.k.a. J.K. Rowling, and I'm very, very excited about this one. I heard it's a lot better than Casual Vacancy, which I had a lot of problems with, so I'm hoping that I really like this one a lot better than Casual Vacancy, which I ended up DNFing, by the way. But yes, I'm very excited to jump into this one. And then I have Crown of Midnight by Sarah J. Mass, which I'm hoping to jump into uh, in November. Um, but I read Throne of Glass a couple months ago, really enjoyed it. So really looking forward to jumping into this one and seeing how the story continues. And then I have I Idols by Margaret Stoll, which is the second book in the Icons trilogy series whatever um i actually read this book last year but i just didn't own it and now i do uh i actually have a review up of icons and idols icons is the first book so i have a review up of these two on my channel if you would like to check that out and see my thoughts and opinions on it uh but this is a sci-fi type of story and this ending is like whoa <laughs> i need the third book now um and then i have Lux Consequences by Jennifer L. Armichal. This is really shiny. Um, and I look really yellow. Um, <laughs> but anywho, I've read the first two books and I cannot wait to jump into books three and four. And then I also have book five, so I can't wait to finish the series and see how it wraps up there. And then I have Blood Ninja 3 by Nick Lake, and this is the third book in the Blood Ninja trilogy. And this is about vampire ninjas. I haven't even started this trilogy yet. But I own all of them, so I can't wait to read this. I love vampires and I love ninjas, so combining them both just sounds incredible. And then I actually have the book that I'm going to be reading next, and that's A Work in Progress by Connor Franta, who is my favorite YouTuber, if you didn't know. Uh, well, I never mentioned my favorite YouTubers on the show on this channel before, but yes, he's my favorite YouTuber. And I finally found his memoir. I know nothing about where memoirs and nonfiction books are in bookstores, but I found this and I'm very, 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 very excited to jump into this. I flipped through it and it looks like it's going to be an incredible read. And finally, I have the UK edition of City of Ashes by Cassandra Clare. And of course, I had to pick this up when I find UK editions of books in American bookstores. I gotta buy them. Yep. <laughs> but anyway, that is it for this video. Let me know what you thought of the books down below. And hopefully I'll be posting videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday if I can. And yes, uh, I will have another video up hopefully Wednesday. And then another video hopefully at Friday. And then hopefully that schedule will continue on and on and on and on. And on. So, yes, that is it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Till next time. Bye!